Hello and welcome to Smart Student Canada. This is the only channel that provides relevant and practical information to students who want to study in Canada. Immigration news, student visa backlogs in Canada. Students from around the world who want to study in Canada are pleading with the Canadian government to issue their student permits and clear backlogs that have been accumulating for months. Concerned students are also using Twitter to express themselves. According to data from the Immigration, Refugees and Citizenship Canada (IRCC), Canada is experiencing a tremendous backlog of more than 2 million applications. If you are waiting for an update on your status, you may have to wait until 2023. When the current backlogs are likely to diminish, Canada Immigration Minister Shian Faisal stated according to a report. On the other hand, students from a variety of nations including India continued to use hashtags like student visa to raise attention to the issue on Twitter. Students are also using hashtags like Hashtag clear backlog, hashtag help us and hashtag wake up IRCC. They claimed that despite of the fact that lessons were about to begin, they still lacked the necessary visas and permits to attend. Companies that provide educational service to pupils from other countries have also run into difficulties. Student visas and permits might take anywhere from 30 to 60 days to be issued by the embassy. According to Vishnu Chaitanya, manager at Advice International in India, Hyderabad. However, not all students are like this. He continued, we don't know how profiles of pupils are being analyzed because some are getting it in around four days. In his speech, he urged students who want to study in Canada to do so as soon as possible. Though a visa backlog has been blamed on the pandemic, other reports claimed that the temporary residency pathway Canada-Ukraine approval for emergency travel, which prioritizes visa for Ukraine family scheme and Ukraine homes for Ukraine applications has contributed to a significant increase in delay. If you want to know more about the percentage required to study in Canada or the fees required to study in Canada as an international student, visit our website. Kindly let us know the topics you would like us to cover in the following video or if you have any queries. We will provide solution to all your questions in our next video. If you like this video or you want to keep watching similar videos, kindly subscribe to our channel and click the bell icon to receive notifications for a new video that we will be publishing on this channel. Also, let your friends and family members access helpful information by sharing this video. Best of luck and have an incredible journey.